you know what I think this is? It's one of those uh, ham radios lets you get Mexico, Europe, Jersey. No. No, it's no radio. It's a very uh, highly sophisticated explosive device. What, are you crazy? It's got no timer, no springs, no explosives, nothing. Well, of course not. It doesn't need any of those things. Th then it's not a bomb. Yes, it's a bomb. It just lacks the fissionable material to make it operational. Fissionable material? Yes. Fish. You mean, uh... Plutonium. Plutonium. Right. Right. Then this is a, a bomb. Yes. It's a... Atomic bomb. bomb. Right. <laughs> well, what you're saying is this, this is a, a mock-up of a... Uh, I mean, it's like an erector set version of... Uh, one of those things. No, a, a smaller version, but a, a practical working model. Oh, about uh, two kiloton, I would judge. <laughs> it's uh, part of my master's thesis. I wanted to do something, uh, you know, uh, a little different. You ought to be congratulated. Uh, Sergeant, uh, is it possible that this is what Mr. Thayer says it is? Oh, come on. Foreigners, there are whole countries that can't make an atomic bomb. Now, how, how can a kid? A little resourcefulness, uh, a little ingenuity. Well, look, uh, just for everyone's peace of mind, Mr. Thayer, if you don't mind, we're going to investigate this a little more fully. We'd appreciate your cooperation. Huh? Well, look, I, uh, I got to turn it in uh, tomorrow morning. Uh, bear with us, Mr. Thayer. I'll write a note to your teacher. <laughs> in the meantime, Wojo, uh, let's get some preliminary information. Right. Sit down. Like what? Like his name, his address, how he built the damn thing? <laughs> nah. Haven't I got a make on Swanson? He's got an office over it. Where the hell's he got the atomic bomb? <laughs>